Now then guys, we're back and uh, I'd just like to say Happy New Year to you all and sorry I've not put one out for a bit but just been busy working and just family stuff. So today I've been out and I've bought a few fuels. I've bought some Tesco, uh, Texaco, I've bought some Gulf, I've bought some Sainsbury's, I've bought some Mosh uh, SO because I wasn't happy with that result and I'm just going to double check that at a totally different station, different place. I bought a wild card Morrison's and I bought a wild card Asda. So um, today we're going to do Texaco and just see how that performs. So the one on the left, that's going to be the standard 810 and the one on the right, that is going to be the super unleaded, uh, super unleaded one. So well, there we've got the 20 mils in the bottom ready to go and I'm going to add in 200 mils and then we'll see what we've got. Right, so I've added those in now. And uh, I've not shaken them up yet. You need to give these, if anybody's doing this at home, you need to give them a really good shake. And when I say a really good shake, I mean a good shake up. So the one on the left is a standard E10. And that came in at 146.9 pence a litre. And then the one on the right which is a Supreme 99 Texaco that came in at 163.9 pence a litre bit of a difference in colour not as big as some of them so I'll give those a shake up and then we'll see what we've got right so I've done that and the one on the left which is a standard E10 petrol that has 5% in it and the one on the right, which is in 99, super unleaded. Now that's gone up just a tiny, tiny touch, probably like 1% now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start again with just that one. I'm going to leave the one there, start again with that one, just to make sure, because it's moved that little amount. Maybe I just slightly put a bit more blue in. I don't, you know, I don't think I did, but I'm just going to retest it and then we'll come back to it. Right, so there we are, we're bang on the 20 mil mark at the bottom. Do a retest on this because I've never seen it move just such a small amount as what it did. Just in case I put a little bit extra in. Uh, I don't want to give a dodgy result, so I'll have the fuel now, give it a good shake, leave it a while, and we'll come back to it. Right, so I've retested it and it's got nothing in it. That Supreme 99 Texaco. Um, it sat there for half an hour, maybe even slightly more, and yeah, I'm impressed with that. I didn't know what that would do at all, it's something I've never used it, it's a really local petrol station, but I always tend to go with things that, you know, I've tried V-Power, Momentum, and, and SO, and I must admit, SO, when I run it in my own car, uh, has been by far the best out of you know in how it feels in the car over v power and momentum um but that's i mean and it's not just i keep getting messages and stuff about this and seeing things it's not just about power all power is great and if i had a way to test it it would be absolutely fantastic unfortunately the only way i could do it is i is put it i don't know really i'd have to go away for analyzing or i could sort of do sort of a, a a bodgy test and I'm not putting it in my car so you know I've got an Impreza RA and I'm, I am putting it in that um, the other thing is I've got some bikes I could put it in that but then I don't think I get a, sort of the feel that you would maybe in a turbo car out of how it actually performs if I put it in like a, a 450 Enduro bike or something or a motocross bike it, I'm not going to get that same feeling and I wouldn't be able to test it properly with so like the air temperature and stuff like that it'd be so inconsistent and it, it just wouldn't be accurate um but yeah i'm really surprised at that it's it's something that i'm actually in the summer when i get the car back out i will try that um so yeah if you like the videos hit the like button and subscribe if you know if you want to it would be great there's lots of people been doing that and people have been commenting and that's been fantastic uh, so yeah, thank you. There'll be some more coming in the next couple of days. Alright then, thank you. Bye.